Hi, welcome back or welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to show you guys how to um, export a video or project rather from Final Cut Pro and import it into DaVinci Resolve. If you find this video helpful, feel free to subscribe. And yeah, without further ado, let's begin. Okay, so the first question you guys may have is why? Why might you even want to do this? Well, let's say that you want to do some color correction or you worked super hard on a project in Final Cut Pro and you just want to load the project up into DaVinci Resolve because you decided that the thing you want to use, your mid switching or whatever the reason. So what we're going to do is simply um, select your project. In this case, it's this project. We're going to File, okay? Click on File, then click Export XML. A thing will pop up. We are going to um, name it just that so we can remember it. And then we will put it wherever we want to. So I'm just going to save it in my downloads folder because why not? And like that, it is saved and ready to go. Next step, when I open. DaVinci Resolve. Now, once you're in DaVinci Resolve and you've created a new file, you want, or a new project rather, you click on File, you go to Import, and then you hit Import Timeline. You locate your timeline and then import it. Now, all of these um, settings should be just find the way they are. If you need to change any, feel free to, but for this purposes, everything should just be fine. You hit OK, and then everything gets imported, okay? Now, in case you're curious why everything imported just right, just fine, that is because of the fact that technically, it's reading it from where they are exactly. So, it's worth noting that if you have a different computer, you will need to actually make sure you have all the media files, like save backed up to a folder, so you can repoint the media to the correct area. And then, once you're in here, you can make all the changes you need and everything. Like for example, we can go to the color thing and then we can, uh, let's just change it here just so I can show you guys what's happening. Okay, and we have the change here. And after we get done with all the changing that we want, we will look up here at render settings. If you scroll all the way over, there should be a Final Cut Pro preset. Um, click on the drop down and hit Final Cut Pro X. Just so you'll have that name it whatever you want. We're going to keep it on that name. Pick the location you want it to go in. Pick the format color, all that stuff you want, and then add to render queue like you normally would, and just render it out. And once that's done rendering it out, we will want to close DaVinci Resolve and reopen the Final Cut Pro. Once we're in Final Cut Pro, we will select the library we want this to be in. And then we will go to File. And then we will go to 
import XML and then after you select the file that you want the XML file we exported in DaVinci Resolve you would see that the changes appear here with the correct everything the color correction we did in DaVinci Resolve and everything now you're free to export it as you want make any final changes you want and whatnot so yeah hopefully this has helped you guys in some way shape or form and with that said i will catch you guys in the future later mm -hmm.